welcome back to our channel today I have only human hair units to review for you guys I know some of you guys always ask for human hair units so I got some today now this first one is one of the Bobby Boss Boss wigs it's a 100% human hair wig unprocessed so that means you can dye it and bleach it and stuff like that and I have her in the color natural now she's called MH1254 Ryan and like I said she's in the color natural so this is the color that you can bleach dye you know customize stuff like that the natural black I don't think you could um I think let me see yes this only comes in natural black and natural so the natural black is already processed to become like black so if you want to process it if you want to change the color get the natural now I didn't show you guys the application up front because I, I'm gonna show you guys throughout the video but I want you guys to look at this here and let me know if you see any difference on this side to this side or does it look the same to you this side let me know what you think <laughs> all right what is this Okay, let me know if you think this side looks different from this side because what I did was, well, first of all, when I got it, it looked like bedhead. And when I said bedhead, I mean bedhead. I took piece, okay, I mixed it with some others. I took piece of hair out from this, like it was just stuck to it. You know like when you have curly hair like this and you just sleep on it for days upon days and it's just flat and it's just it looks matted that's how it looked no it wasn't matted at all because I was able to run my fingers through it really easy but it just looked really I'm pretty sure you guys understand what I'm talking about so I shook it upside down before I even put it on so it kind of fluffed it all to give it that you know a little fluff out and it was like, sticking up so I decided to use mousse on one side this side is the side I use the mousse on and I use water on the other side just to see because I mean it's human hair so I was like you know what water is definitely going to work mousse is definitely going to work but I want to see which one works better and stuff like that but it seems to me like they both work the same except with the water obviously it gets a little bit flatter because it's wet it's drenched so it will take a little while once you add water to it add a lightweight oil so that way when it's um when it dries it's not too frizzy and it's not too dry so um yeah so i think it's a little bit flatter whereas where i add the mousse it still has a little bit of body to it so if you're gonna wear this right away straight out the house i would suggest the mousse because like i said you get the same effect except this one is wetter obviously because you drench it with water so if you want like a fuller effect faster effect then use the mousse if you have time and you want to use the water and add some oil to it and just let it dry and you know air dry and stuff like that you can definitely use the water on this side but to me personally it looks almost the same like I said except one side seems a little bit flatter because of the water and this side has a little bit more volume now this is exactly how it comes I mean you could pull it like make a little part going for yourself or something it's really up to you however you want to wear this but it's mainly like a little bang unit because it comes with a regular, well not even a regular corn closure. It's like a bunch of hair up here. I don't even know where the closure is exactly, but it's just, it's just there, okay? <laughs> but like I said, you can switch it to the side, make like a little part. Let me see. And to me, it seems like when I use the water, I have to use a lot of water. So it's not like, oh, just spritz it a little bit and you're good. No, you actually have to use a lot of water in order to, like, you know, get the curls looking, popping and stuff like that. Apart from that, it just looks really dry and matted. But anyway, let me know how you feel about this. Um, the unit doesn't come with any combs whatsoever, but they do have the adjustable straps at the back so you can adjust it to fit your head size. Um, the cap, I would say, is definitely big head friendly. It has a lot of room in there and stuff like that. But I mean, to each its own, if you really like this wig, the link to it will be in the comment section. Under the the link will be in the description box down below um, so you can go purchase it like I said it only comes in natural black and natural but yeah um, let me know what you guys think like subscribe follow us on all social media accounts everything is at Wake Terrace and I'll see you guys pretty soon bye